The next Land Cruiser Prado, Toyota's off-road capable huge SUV, is rumored to debut in the middle of 2023, according to Japanese media. It is currently unknown what will power the vehicle. After hearing from Toyota insiders that the new Prado would take design cues from the 70s series, the Japanese magazine Best Car has generated a new graphic showing what it anticipates the 2019 Prado to look like. The publication's focus is on the rounder headlights within the light clusters. Best Car's educated assumption is that the new Prado will borrow heavily from the Land Cruiser 300, while retaining signature Prado features like the vertical grille arrangement. It is, however, not clear what, if any, mechanical alternatives Australia will have once the new Prado arrives. The Prado is expected to adopt a hybrid powertrain similar to the Toyota Crown sold in markets outside of Australia. This powertrain uses a turbocharged 2.4-liter .4 four-cylinder petrol engine and a rear-axle-mounted electric motor. Despite the brand's dedication to still using diesel engines in the LC300 in the soon-to-be-updated 70 series, it is unclear if this drivetrain will be available on the new Prado from launch. Toyota's whole lineup, save for the GR performance models, is scheduled to make the switch to electricity by the end of the decade, as previously reported by Cars Guide. At the beginning of 2023, Toyota Australia's Vice President of Sales and Marketing, Sean Hanley, said, by 2030. We expect to have an electrified version of every model in our local range, excluding performance cars, and we will continue to evaluate all EVs for this market as they are made available. More specifically mentioning the Prado, among other models, at a 2022 media event, Hanley said that electrification would likely occur much sooner than Toyota's self-imposed deadline. As we approach that time, it is inevitable that commercial vehicles like the Land Cruiser, Prado, Hilux, and others will incorporate some form of electrification. I don't want people to think that by 2030 means any time between now and 2029. We'll begin setting things up on the road to 2030. Electrification is rapidly gaining momentum in this market. And as an agile business, we need to be flexible enough to meet those needs as they arise. As we get closer to the midpoint of the year, we should have more concrete details about the next generation Prado.